Wobsamung Independent Nation Social Services presents Employment Through Ontario Works. This community, also known as White Dog, is located 120 kilometers northwest of Kenora, Ontario, with a land base of 21,000 acres. With approximately 1,700 community members and just 900 on reserve, the OW serves just under 300 clients. The unemployment in this community is roughly around 80%, which is actively being addressed by the OW, formerly known as Welfare Administration Office. The OW program offers a variety of activities to prepare its clients for employment. Clients must fulfill participation agreements and complete community hours through the following projects. Wapsamung's Cultural Week. The creation of this drum called upon the skills and strength of many local men in bringing this sacred item to life. Beating and dreamcatcher making was another highlight of this event, as many women came together and shared their stories and knowledge with one another. The KCR Camp Cabin Girl and Guiders Training Program gave five participants the opportunity to get hands-on experience in this field of employment. Professional development for OW clients enables them to gain confidence and develop a plan for reaching employment and life goals. ho -wa. Daryl, what can you tell us about the Jadel Lake project? Well, what we did is we did, uh, we did some sharing circles and stuff and we got close. We got to know each other a little more than we, than we did that growing up together. And it's just a nice little quiet camp, no generator, nothing. We go out fishing and they teach us to cut the fish and how to smoke it and stuff. And just a lot of traditional living, like traditional living. And it just gave me a sense of peace, a sense of peace, you know. There's, there is a nice and quiet things going on out there instead of what we experience here in the, on the reserve and in Genoa and stuff. To go out there and say, Oh wow, this is so nice and peaceful, and I got to learn to do this and do that. So it's quite a, uh, it's a very good experience for me, anyways. In your opinion, what has Ontario Works done for you? Well, on a personal level, it's helped me quite a bit. It gave me that uh, that, that, in, that incentive to, to, to continue uh, job searching kind of thing instead of sitting around for two weeks and waiting for welfare. It gave me that sense of achievement. And um, what I noticed when this Ontario Works started, I noticed uh, people working together now to, to earn that particular amount that they get every two weeks. 
And that, that's a positive thing that I'm noticing because I see people working together to earn, to earn their, their, their welfare check. And that's something they hardly ever see around their people working together as one, just to achieve one certain thing. I know it's only welfare, but it's a, I think it's a good thing to have this Ontario Works thing happening. And personally, I was able to experience some work that I, with my uh, with my welfare, I worked with uh, the cleanup crew, and um, it was fun. It was a lot of fun, and it gave me a lot of sense to, to know that I am earning my welfare instead of just sitting around and waiting for it to give me a sense of achievement. In order to fulfill participation agreements, clients can complete hours through community placements. Daryl, what kinds of activities would count towards your participation agreement? There's a lot of things we can do. We can do um, I'm sure we could work our own, say, for myself, for example, I could go to a handicapped person's house and do my hours there, eight hours a day, whatever it requires, for how much or I need, how many hours I need to put in. Hmm. And that, that gives me a sense of, you know, like I said before, achievement, you know, I'm able to to earn what I'm getting from the government, the, the welfare. And it just gives me, gives me a sense of, you know, I'm doing something, man. The most recent Honoring Our Clients project sets out to publicly honor those who have completed the GED program. This three-day event will invite community members and stakeholders to share their views on how Ontario Works is mutually benefiting for the whole community. And remember, the Ontario Works staff are here to help you. One last question, Daryl. What would you tell others about Ontario Works? My own personal point, I would just tell them to just to try it. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna, you'll earn something, you'll get something out of it. I think it's a good thing that this Ontario Works thing is happening. Mm -hmm. I see people hanging around here at the welfare office and sweeping up and picking up garbage and stuff, and that's something you normally don't see when they're when nothing like this, this kind of program doesn't happen. And that's a very positive thing for the people of Wapsin. Due to the lack of employment and everything, this way it gives them a sense of achievement.
Why are you the water? <laughs> oh my god. Where's my love for chicken? <laughs> Photobomb. <laughs> So what are the what are the uh, sites to see? I'm not. <laughs> 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 <laughs>